Also, my cursor is lagging. What the heck? How's the cursor lag? Um, logic. That, that's that's not very good logic. <laughs> Never said good, did I? True statement there. All right. So now I need to spam ice towers. A. Every time in outer space. This, right, has this to be is the, the no reset Best run. defense I've ever seen. It's glorious. A lot of submarines. A lot of submarines. A lot of zero zero ice towers, which don't even do anything. I mean, they basically don't do anything. They can't pop anything. Oh gosh, I might actually. I don't have very good defense, so that means spam spike factories. A bunch of spike factories. And what's the hockey for to that? M. That makes logical sense. Well, the thing is, like, it's using every single button in order because there's that many towers. It goes all the way to K, which is actually pretty far. And then it still uses L. Wait, what? It goes backwards for. Okay, now I'm confused. Wait. Never mind. It goes. Actually, now I don't know, because it's weird. L, M, what? It goes to M, and then it goes to B? <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't understand anymore, never mind, I just, just, just forget it. There's, there's no logic here. What's logic? I don't know, man. It's made up. Yeah, it sounds about right. Wow, I have, like, no camo detection. Not like I need that. Spam ninjas! But I don't need to spam ninjas, do I? Yeah, I don't need to spam ninjas. That's that's useless. That's like wasting time. How dare you waste time? I know. Let's spam monkey aces. That's that's much better. What hockey is that? F. Press F to pay respects to the monkey aces that are being spammed on this map. Even though there's not much room to spam them because they're huge. All right, I pressed F. Respect. I'm actually like really considering getting one of the SGDQ hat shirts. Cause that uh, looks yeah, cool. I know. <laughs> I want. I just don't know if I want to get like the general GDQ one or the one that. I think I want to get like both. <laughs> Honestly. So it's what? Aren't they like twelve dollars, fourteen dollars, something like that? I think it was like twelve. That'd be cool, that. I don't get shirts. Yeah, Honestly, like, you should do. It's a hat shirt. That makes it even better. <laughs> it's, like, it's a hat shirt, and it has Celeste, and it has Cuphead, and it has Mario, and then it's like, oh my gosh, you just overwhelmed me, sir. You've given me everything I had ever want on a shirt. How have I not gotten this upgraded? I mean, do I need to use like upgraded towers? Does that increase my experience gain? They could have added um snatcher. They could have. That would have been a clearly superior game. Or shirt. Oh, wait, I mean shirt. Shirt game. I was <laughs> thought you were talking about this for a second. But like, wait, that's not what you're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, a I really just... better game. Add Snatcher to this <laughs> Bloons game. I mean, it's it wouldn't make the game better. <laughs> it would. That Honestly... actually should be so cool. Cause you just have like a bunch of little minions walking across the screen. <laughs> Honestly, Snatcher should just be in every game. <laughs> you should. Not even like a cameo. It is his game. <laughs> he owns all games. <laughs> yeah. You'll just see him in a Mario platformer. <laughs> Oh. You let the princess get captured again. <laughs> nice. How is it getting so little progress? I don't understand. Oh wait, I am in a free play mode, that's probably why. Hey, but I got to rank 43, I unlocked the 4th tier engineer upgrades. Congratulations. Pogchamp. 
but the thing is unlocking them and having the XP to unlock them is not the same thing. Unlocking them means you can now grind the XP needed to actually unlock them. <laughs> it's a double process. And honestly, I think I need to do regrow farming on this map now. Assuming it's actually a good map for regrow farming. Skull Peak is not a good map for regrow. Wait. Actually, uh, I think you can maybe do it. Let's skip this. Wait. Three times around is even worse for it. Actually, wait, no. I have to think about this. Oh, uh, I got 120.17 out of space. Let's go backwards and then up here. Wait, how do you get a 10% bonus on three dart monkeys? What? We're just talking about the money. I have no idea. It's weird. Okay, whatever. I can do patch. Here we go. I can do. I can definitely do. We go farming on this. I will continue. I know I'm removing my amazing save file. Wow, I'm a real speedrunner. I didn't even place a tower, and I already started the round. Even though the timer technically doesn't begin until you press start, but, you know. Can't waste those frames. <laughs> Even if they don't count towards the run, don't waste the frames. Listen, frames are frames. Might be a picture frame someday. You'll have a picture of your world record on a wall. <laughs> I actually wonder if people do that. I hope not. <laughs> I'm sure there's somebody out there. It's like, I got my video game world record and I just like posted it on my wall. Like, what would you post on there though? Like, the leaderboards, the picture of like the screen where you got the record? Like, I mean, if it's like a hat in time, you post like the final screen, you've got like the wave, the cough, fuff picture, not the flare bear picture. But I mean, not all games have a thing like that, you know? Like, well, that game's I don't have any game timer. Do you take a picture of the timer, the leaderboard, your game? Live split? Your face? <laughs> just, 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 just your face in general. You just have your face reaction. And then, like, below it, you'll be like, I got a time. <laughs> I did. You don't even put the time. You just put, <laughs> I got a time. You say, I did a thing. I did a thing. In a game. It was great. Honestly, this is quality gameplay right here. I've been using the same tower to start probably like all of these maps except for two. And those two maps I use basically the same start after a few rounds. So, still the same start. Nice. Because I mean, it's so good. It's like a good start. Until I get specialty buildings, then I do engineer start. Which is apparently like a mega speedrun strat because every map I've seen, they just start with an engineer at the front and you're good to go. Which is actually surprising, but understandable. V. Oh yeah, four sandbags. Poggers. Wait, that means you reset again. Yes, I said I reset in outer space. Stop resetting! This is a no reset run. I do not permit resets in this Discord. <laughs> I literally I, said, up, oh, I reset in outer space. <laughs> All right, this one's going to be the real no reset run. Well, um, I'm going to have to ban you. There are no resets allowed in this Discord. I'll have you know, I do not reset in my runs. Ever? No one has ever seen me reset a run. It's because you've never done it. Anyone that does has, like, never... Seen you play the game. Me play. <laughs> no one has ever seen me play the game, so I've clearly never reset. Confirmed. Every PB you get is the first draft. Yeah. I got the Super Mario 64 120 star world record first try. Never even played the game before, just sort of did it. I I I I just learned on the fly, man. <laughs> you just. You save some frames here, and you save some frames there. The record's pretty unoptimized, I mean. Yeah, I mean, like, what's Cheese 05 doing over there? Sending, Think taking a whole hour 39. What a waste of time. It could have been better spent, because if you would have just BLJ'd 
all the way over there, which I'm pretty sure that's not even allowed in the run. If it is, it's light. Actually, I don't think it is. I don't remember. I don't know. I just watch the runs every once in a while just because they're cool to watch. Okay. I'm, can't, I'm checking because I'm bored. <laughs> we're going to look at the official speedrun.com rules for Super Mario 64 120 star. Not Super Mario 64 DS Extra Online IQ Madness 1.5 <laughs> Zatara Attack Relax Your Life Seaside Town Temple Explorer The Green Stars Jack Short Extensions HD Remake and more. How many more are there? Seven. Twenty results per page. And there's two pages. Are they we have forty results per page? Oh my gosh. 64 category extensions online DS the green stars HD remake chaos editions the tire attack Twisted adventures twisted adventures v2.0 madness temple explorer relax your life extra multiplayer the missing star seaside town IQ roblox edition <laughs> <laughs> Revenge of the others the final star nice it's a lot of Super Mario 64. Let's view the rules. All forms of BLJ are allowed. Oh. See, I don't actually remember seeing a lot of BLJs in the runs. Maybe there's not that many Ultima ones? I guess not. I'm too used to seeing pan and build up speed. For only two hours. I cry, that meme is dead. Also, I have no defense. Let me think. Let me look at my upgrades once more and see what tower I can spam. Let's spam cannons. Why do I spam cannons? With why? That wasn't an answer, but good enough. Because cannons are totally effective. No, that was actually kind of fast to switch all that. Oh wait, I forgot I'm supposed to be regrow farming this time. <laughs> Silly. I don't have to worry about it yet, because like it's on round 42 and I just have to save up a bunch of money. Shouldn't be that bad. I should start building it up though. So, ice tower over here. Village over here. Should put the village first, because that saves money, but you know... Whatever, who needs money? Money's not important. Actually, I really don't need money. I mean, it's not that expensive. I'll be impressed if I can get it without getting any of these farms sold, but... Okay. I need double wizards. Um, honestly, I want them where the farms are. I actually kind of wish there was a backspace on the left side of the keyboard. Sounds like a weird thing, but like, it actually be kind of helpful. For this rare scenario where I need to press backspace as a hotkey. <laughs> <laughs> Let's turn on tooltips, because why not? Alright, infinite defense has been created. 
poggers. All right, now let's just make the infinite regrow. Okay, what's the wizard? H. H for Harry. Wizard. For Harry Potter. H <laughs> for wizard. Just, just screw actual logic. Just for wizard. H for wizard, man. Do you look um, at the options? Is uh, the way to change these? What? Is there a way to change those, like, in the options I or anything? I have no idea. There might be, but... I'm not sure I'd want to change them. I'd actually be pretty surprised if you could change them. Alright, here we go. If this regrow farm fails, I'm gonna be very sad. Oh gosh, it's not doing very good. Regrow! The regrow farm failed because it didn't... Free go. <laughs> there's okay. There's still one more round I can do this. Time. Whatever. Well, let me build a ground zero real quick and just wait. I don't have ground zero. Let me just build a fourth tier buccaneer for no reason to kill this Moab. Hey, I have an activated ability. The first time ever. Cool. I'll save up money. So apparently this placement is too OP. It can actually kill stuff. I don't, I don't know. That. Why not? Because the whole point is I want it to infinitely regrow. I don't want it to kill everything. Oh, uh, good point. It needs to be so overwhelming that it can't do anything and it's just panicking. And then I've got this guy chilling in the back. Literally chilling. It's called an ice tower. And then it just does all the work because it's infinite popping power. Because, you know, that's the game logic. It's actually crazy how it's infinite, but. Just how it is. Is there like a hotkey for abilities? I doubt it. I swear I'm gonna look at this and then there's gonna be a hotkey. Ability hotkeys! <laughs> Depending on how many abilities you have activates each one. Thanks someone. Oh. Ah, okay. Ability achieved. And I've leveled up my ice tower. Poggers. Congratulations. Alright. Well I don't need any of this stuff anymore. I just have to rate for round 49. I'm just going to demonstrate the OP-ness of Ice Tower by just having it be the only thing that pops up. I'm going to try again to set this up. Maybe if I don't have much tower coverage, it'll be better. So that might be a problem. Wait, can I do like just one maybe? Try just one and then I'll place the other one as the round goes. Please work, because otherwise I've literally wasted my time doing this. Less RNG. Less RNG. Plus RNG. Wait. Oh, I think we did it. Wow, this dice tower is actually like getting it really close. All right, here we go. Hold up, hold up, stop lagging. Hold up, that's not how this works. Ice Tower is called Infinite Defense. Let me just place two. <laughs> Which makes it even more infinite. It doesn't have enough track radius, I guess. There we go. Now the game's lagging.
If only I can make this more efficient. Let's try adding a third. Oh gosh, game is lagging. Three infinite damages? Damn. Yeah, this was a really good MDS, and then I missed the, tr and then I, I just like barely missed the trigger for the trap. Oh dang! What happens if I put a fourth wizard? And I try and no, not that one. That one actually kills stuff. Oh, just a third tier. You don't want to actually kill stuff. That's just me. Nope. If you saw the stream, um. I'm not sure you'd know what you'd be seeing. Yeah, probably not. Well, I, even if you knew what you were seeing, I'm not sure you'd know what you were seeing. <laughs> Doug, I, I feel like if I do worse than your Lilacs mail, then we have a serious, serious problem. I also forgot to put Hookshot on. Wait, what? Uh, Doka's uh, mail delivery and uh, his Lilac run was apparently atrociously bad. Oh. Like, I lost like 20 seconds and he said it was still faster. Wow. Okay, this game is getting laggy. And I don't know how. That means I've got a lot of stuff on this screen. I'm not even sure if that's efficient at that point, because if you're just lagging and it's slower. Okay, fine, I'll sell one. I can't even click a tower! It's so slow! Hello, game? Never mind, I can't click anything! Rip the game. Let me try alt tabbing or something. It 
Ralph's literally not even responding to my inputs. Wow. Nice. Um, I don't know what to do now. I can't do anything. Control alt delete. No. I don't want to lose all this progress. I can't leave, so I can't get all my progress. Um. Hmm. Well, I mean, I've got my monkey mouse clicking around here. I ain't doing anything. I don't know, I can't click anything, so... Uh, this is how they patch it. They make it so if you do it, you soft lock. <laughs> hey, wait! No! It clicked something! No! 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 Oh! It's... Oh! It's... Oh gosh. Sell it. Sell the tower. I wonder if it's actually gonna go through every single one of my inputs. <laughs> just just sell the tower, please. No, don't click off the tower. Click on the tower. As it reads through every single input you've done in the last half hour. <laughs> it, it's it's going through some input. Oh, it paused the game. Oh, now it's it. It's, it's, I don't know what it's doing. I feel like it's actually going through my inputs because it's like clicking at different times. Okay, I can click normally again. Oh wait, yo, I don't could go. leave, but nah. Um. Sell it. One sec. Sell you. Sell you. All right, we're just ending the farm. No more. Even though I could get to rank fifty. Wait, Doka, do you still do parade deaths so conductor wins, or do you sort of just like hope that happens? Alright, I have a million dollars. What shall I do with it? Okay, I just wanted to make sure. Ring 49. Oh, right, because you don't have to go through the um, credits thing at the end. You can just back the hub. I wasn't even thinking of that part. What the fuck was that potion? Not a potion. It just like fell in my hand and I threw it across the freaking thing thing like across the arena hmm. per snatcher it's not like you needed it all right here we go just spam sun gods cuz one isn't enough g If only I could spam temples, but I can't do that yet, so I guess Sun Gods will have to do. Alright, Alpine take three. Dang. That's a lot of takes. It is. Alright, sandbox mode unlocked. The only mode that counts. Honestly, I think I enjoy sandbox more than the actual game. Because it's just infinite money. Mess around with whatever you want. Break the game. Wait. I'm guessing there's blue and hot keys. Blue and hot keys. All the numbers. <laughs> I don't know how that works with abilities, but okay. Okay.
See what's something dumb I can do in sandbox for no reason. Um, place lots of with lots of wizards and lag the game again. I mean, I could, but I do it with regrow ceramics, which makes the game even more laggy <laughs> because it's e even more. Or I just spam oh my gods, which is just like the biggest thing you can pop. Eh, just do whatever eight. you want. Here we go. Here we go. Just I'm just gonna spam oh my gods. As many oh my gods as I can fit on the screen. Um. I hate this jump. I, right, fuck it. The funny part is when you spam every single thing. You can see. Every Every individual f of animation it goes through, <laughs> because you see all of them cycling through. It's so weird, but it's pretty cool. I probably only need like 250 pawns or something like that out of Alpine. Um, you can normally get like 300 in like ATP, and I uh -huh. and I come in here with over 100 as it is. Um, pawns are pretty hard to get in um, all X. Oh dang. Yeah, because I'm. Don't going... you have to get scooter? No. Oh. I mean, you can. I don't know why I thought that. Wait, wait, it... is there another RNG thing in that too? Um. I mean, the only reason you get Scooter is pretty much for Groove's quick kill. I don't think it... Oh, yeah. Just because of Scooter, I don't know how much worth it would be. I know it only saves 20 seconds in ATP, but you have to do a bit more pawn farming. So I don't know how much that takes into it. Maybe Doka knows. We'll see if he says something. Oh, okay. Yeah, it still saves time for all that. It stays actually a bit more. Apparently, most of that time is for um, pond farming. Huh. I mean, Groove's Quick Kill is so much faster than Conductor Quick Kill. I mean, it is the hardest trick in the game. Next to reward ceremony. You know, like... True. Of course. Alright. I think I've done it. Every single frame of this screen has a oh my god on it. I mean, Doka, you're not wrong. That's why I don't do it. And you thought you were good at balloons. Wait, can I murder any of this? Giant monstrosity? Wait, let me just get like a ton of these. F. I have to pay respects. I have to pay respects. Here we go. And then um, just spam these. I don't have the ground zero. I can't do it. Whatever. Never mind. I can't even kill it. 
I can slow I can slow it down though for no reason. Um, I have nothing to insta-kill anything. Oh well, I'll just watch it play out. Just still really cool to watch. Alright, let's see if I can do this part first try. And then the most OP blue in the game. Well, that wasn't the part I was talking about, but whatever. Here we go. There we go. Birdhouse is one of the most like weirdly difficult levels, honestly, like in the entire run. I know I could probably give SDJ to make that a little faster, but ah, I've never done it before. I didn't want to risk it. Guess I should probably end the stream. So I'm not really doing anything anymore. <laughs> Thanks for watching, people who might have watched. And see y'all. And on that note, I don't know what to do. <gasps> Alright, I almost had a heart attack. <laughs> What'd you do? I almost d d did a dive boost right past the timepiece and off the edge in Birdhouse. <sighs> oh gosh. Like, my heart actually stopped for a second. <laughs> and it was that moment he knew. Actually, I genuinely don't know what to do now. Hmm. I played Terraria, but I was told to stop. Wait, so whatever. You could learn ATP. I mean, I could, but, um, do you see any tutorial for conductor quick kill lying around? Um, there's the out of bounds one that you said. It's like oh, I'm just gonna do that one. I know, but I'm still waiting. Plus, that is you know at the end of the run. What the heck? Okay. Um. There's a whole you know thirty other. You could look at Discord. At all. Um. I doubt it, but. <laughs> not since you did post your thing. Why? Because, um, I just saw, like, the funniest thing ever. It has nothing to do with what I posted before. But whenever you get a chance, I'll have it. Like, I'll message you it. <laughs> I don't really have much downtime for the run, so I'll probably check it after whenever this dies. Or I if this somehow doesn't die. Because I did promise you a nosy reset Don't run. Kill it. Don't kill it. Right, it's in the end. <laughs> Honestly, Conductor Quick is the only thing I'm really worried about right now. And Twilight Bell a little bit, but... Honestly, this hasn't been a pretty a bad run so far. Isn't that like the worst thing to say? Probably. Don't kill your run. Plus RNG. Well. 
Wait, what just? Um. Okay, where do I go? Alright, I'm gonna watch your stream now. Alright, I found my way back. Can't wait to see the epic windmill skip. Well, you better hurry, because I'm doing it right now. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm watching it right now. <laughs> I was so like whenever I first saw that I just that that was like that blew my mind that you could even do that honestly I really enjoyed watching Twilight Bell um in like the old ATP runs with all the zipping gone. around is that like gone now yeah yeah wall climb skip it Oh yeah, the wall, the giant annoying wall climb that you can bonk and start all the way over. Yep. With the wall climb. Oh wait, and that's what I'm about to see. I assume. Hopefully. Also, I hate that stupid checkpoint because that would have saved my bingo, man. <laughs> I had no idea that was there. <laughs> I still don't know where it is. You literally just jump, jump towards that black spot on the wall and you make it. I'm gonna have to look at like the volumes to actually know where it is. Yeah, if you look at the volumes, it's pretty odd. I mean, it sticks out only a tiny bit, but it's still there. Mm -hmm. Honestly, like you can just double jump, sprint jump. I tend to try DSJ just because I like practicing those, given mm -hmm. the opportunity. All right, let's see how many people are running the game. Wow, there's a lot of people. I must admit. What? There's a lot of people playing the game. Like, there's a lot of streams up. How many views does the game have total? 88. And Damn. 23 on one and 13 on another and then 11 and then 11 and then 6, 4, 4, 3, 3, 2, 2, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 0, 0, 0, 0. <laughs> Which means they aren't even watching their own stream. I hate this jump so much. Better than Odyssey, you say? I do say. All right, there we go. Wall climb time. Wait, is this guy actually doing it? No, oh, I guess he's just not fine. Not like this. Also, how are you actually supposed to do like the thing at the end where you get up from the wall climb? Uh, I was just kind of doing it, but I never actually knew how you were supposed to do it. One Just second. Consistently. Uh, you mean the part where you like dive cancel? Like what? Oh, that's yeah, what I do. Just like actually Does getting it... up. Um, let me get. Just. I just kind of looked at spies. I um. I just sort of copy what Doka does. Um, I've just figured out how many di uh, times I go back and forth, and then when I know uh -huh. I'm on the last one, I just start holding left or up left. I mean, and then uh just. Do my double jump dive cancel and then start holding right after I hit the dive cancel. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Hmm. The hard part was figuring out how many how like to consistently get the same height. I might integrate that into my new Ahatan and IL world record. I'll beat my thirty four fifty six twenty eight. It's gonna be pretty hard, but I think I can do it. I mean, you did miss a couple TSJs, so there's some free time yeah, save right there. I, I did. I got a slingshot, though. Ooh, that's gonna be... Damn. If you get the two TSJs, you may be comfortable to miss the uh, slingshot. <laughs> It'll be close, though. Honestly, like, I was just, like, sitting there. I'm just thinking, what can I do over here? <laughs> For 30 thought, minutes. Hey, let's do a slingshot! <laughs> Yeah, I didn't AFK my run, so at least Flair got to watch stuff. Even though it wasn't Flair that verified it. I know, Flair hasn't been verifying like any of our stuff. How dare Flair be at GDQ right now?
raising money for charity. You. For a good cause. He's such a nice guy. He won't do a cat kid cosplay while he's doing his run, though. That's... Okay, now that's evil. <laughs> Actually, he should dress up as Hat Kid in a dino costume. <laughs> 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 and then he gets a dino hat in the run. <laughs> I mean, he's already gotten it twice in practice. I know. That's the funny part. It's gonna be funny if he gets it in the run. Do you think he'll take it off in the run? Uh, he might, honestly. If he does, then I'm going to I'm going to wait That's for my donation until to, like probably after <laughs> until subcon. Until he does it. Now, I'm gonna say it's like after subcon uh, probably, because I still want them to read it. Mm -hmm. I think I'm actually gonna donate. I wanna hope that's red. <laughs> I'll donate, I'll get my shirts. It's gonna be all good. thought there was one more hookshot for a second, so I'm sort of just doing whatever, and then all of a sudden I see him hugging the wall, I'm like, oh shit, gotta climb. Honestly, I'm not even sure what your time is, or anything. Oh, wait, oh, now I can see. Everything's clear now. Yeah, for some oh, reason... Never mind. Oh, it's, it's, it's all gone. Yeah, I don't... I gotta got look through my settings. I might just lower the resolution in the end, honestly. Of my, uh, sh sh the stream in general. Mm -hmm. I just, I, I've been meaning to that for like... What do you like... have it set to? <sighs> I can't remember if I ever changed it off of 1080, to be honest. You have it on 1080? I have mine on 72030. And even then, mine still lags. Like, it's I know I, at one point was, I can't remember if I ever changed it. So, yeah, I'd change it to 720. Like, why are you playing the game? 720. <laughs> so, change it to 720, it's not even a change. Well, this it actually does change. Wait, would it be 720, but it's upscaled to the size of a 1080 screen, and then it's being viewed in 720, Wait. and then some weird junk that tech savvies would know about resolutions? I have no idea, honestly. I have no idea, either. Alright, so that was interesting. Uh, I don't know if you noticed, but that did not go according to plan. Um, I don't know, it looked pretty normal to me. Totally. I mean, like, you you just kind of, like, did some stuff, then some other stuff. Honestly, I don't know how to describe it, but, like, I kind of saw something. When I went back on that little shot? You, you yeah, okay. And then ah. I sort of hit some lava that wasn't there, I think. <laughs> yep. Now, what you should do is go to Finale, and then pick up the cherry, and then just take the cherry on an adventure. So you get to one of those weird platforms, and then you understand the invisible teleporting cherry. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, sh I'll hell? be sure to do that while I do finale skip. Actually, just, just get the cherry and take it to finale skip. <laughs> I kind of want to know if you can take it through that Can way. you wall climb? I don't know. You can't wall climb with the cherry, but... I don't know. I wonder if you could, like, have it bounce on your head. <laughs> as you wall climbed? Maybe? I mean, you wouldn't be moving from the spot, you just have to hope the cherry doesn't bounce outward, I think. I don't know. I mean, it wouldn't help. I've already taken it, like, all the way to the fight, and it doesn't really do anything. You can force it to go underground, but that's about it. That's just during the stupid laser attack where it's already bad enough that she goes underground. All I'm hoping is that this finale goes better than my ATP one. Do it.
I have so many pawns. That's stupid. I agree. Oh wow, that's a double stupid. Oh, okay, now that's triple sprint and jump stupid. Yeah, I Infinite knew that was sprint jump stupid. <laughs> Did you miss it? Did you get it from that spot? Oh, you missed it. Okay, that's um. I don't know what. <laughs> Zero sprint jump, stupid. <laughs> Zero a press, stupid. <laughs> that's not stupid anymore. It can be done. I can't wait to see the 70 star zero a presses run, which is. Done on Wii Virtual Console because it's the only one that you can run it on. Still kind of sad that N64 doesn't even have them because of different methods of calculation. Oh, I have right more than enough. Thank you. You're welcome. No, wait, let me get the better one. <laughs> I mean, there's multiple better ones, but... Here's... Here's one of the better ones. And then let me get Doka's. I think it was Doka. I'm gonna assume it was Doka. I mean, Doka posted. Basically Doka. There we go. What have I walked into? <laughs> well, it depends on what you mean by what you've... If you're referring to my text, which I have gloriously spammed across this, it is called Big Parade Copy Pastas. One of them is good, the other two are disrespecting it because it's gone. Except for here and some other place. <laughs> and another place. It's still in 75% of the categories, but you know, we just ignore that. 
75 percent of the people now, don't play those <laughs> on the off chance that you're actually talking about the run it's a level that just isn't so great But either way, what you've walked into is a great experience. Oh my god. That was just stupid. Wait, do you do any of the warps? I tried, but I accidentally um spammed oh. from the mashing too quickly. <laughs> Swung my umbrella, okay. and they knocked me onto the ground. <laughs> I did the wait, first so did one. You do the okay, yeah. I can't wait to go back to parade doing ATP and then have to do the warps again. <laughs> Didn't you not do them for so long in the first place because you never, never had Ice Hat by then? Yeah, and then I finally switched Ice Hat. And, and then, then I <laughs> started doing it. Finally. Whenever I didn't miss, because like, you can easily just miss with the Ice Hat, and then if you don't land on it, then you're already screwed because you can't do it. You know, if only the things I found were like, easy and useful. <laughs> but you know, I find Brewer Clipping. I find stuck warping under this stuff, or void warping, or wrong warping, or whatever you people call it. Stuck warping is what I'm gonna just stick with. I don't even know why my mouse shows up on my splits for some reason. Like, that usually doesn't happen. And I find TSJing on her <laughs> patch to step the gate, which I'm watching Sewer do for like 30 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> he got better at it over that time, I must say. He got better. But my gosh, I find it really consistent, so it's kind of funny. Because, like, all of my current patch files, like, none of them have the gate down. It's still up on all of them, <laughs> so I just... I'm used to it. It's honestly weird to see the gate down. I like how heating up Mafia Town is, like... Near the end of the This is so weird. Oh my gosh, I never get to see this place. This is so cool. Wait. That was a mistake. <laughs> that was a mistake. <laughs> I was confused. I was just like, why did you do that? Honestly, it would have been more funny if you actually went to DBS and then had to go all the way back. That would have, honestly. But cool, I actually get to experience this level in low resolution. Not like I've already experienced it before. I get I get the full speedrunner experience. And not me trying to tell you stuff that's hard to explain with words. <laughs> yeah. That owl over there! The <laughs> one with the green thing! <laughs> you know what? Go it's hard. It. No, the other one! They're all <laughs> green! Hey, no, one of them's blue. Fine, blue. Then they're all blue. No, one's blue, the rest are green. And then you say you're colorful. Yeah, that's not really how it works, but... Never know. This is such a weird category. It really is. Like, why is heating up there? Is it because you don't have pawns? Yep. Wait, so why do you not have pawns? How many pawns do you need for this? You wouldn't have any of the relic pawns needed, so that saves a bit. But... I don't know, I don't really see it being that much more expensive. You don't get um, sewer pawns, we don't get vault pawns because they're not really needed. Oh, okay. Yeah, that would like 
move it back. So actually, wouldn't you need like less pawns then? Well, I mean, obviously more than any percent because you have 150 for parade, but that's it. It's only 30 more than any percent actually. Wait, why? 30? Wait, no, sorry, sorry, no. My bad. I was um, thinking old route. Um, would it be 50? It'd be a hundred. It'd be the same amount. Of no, it'd be a hundred because just because we got the relic, but not big parade. Oh yeah, it would be a hundred. Wait. No. Yes. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. Stack orbs, man. The greatest thing that's ever happened. Wait, are you actually doing like the real one? Yeah. Ooh. I learned it. Alright. Never mind, I'm I'm poggers. I wanna see this. Don't you just love this RNG right now? Oh my god, conductor. <laughs> Watch him just jump out of bounds. Just hate you. That's happened before, actually. Wow. Is it possible for him to, like, take too long or something? Uh, if he gets... You know the part where you, uh, he sits at the table? Yeah. If he reaches that phase, then you have to go back and bounce. But, like, how would he reach that phase? Um, because you keep on dealing damage to him, but if you don't kill him before then, then you have to go back and bounce. Wait, so... How does damage work in terms of, like, moving the phases versus... I don't know. Moving his actual health. I honestly have no idea. Because you think, like, if you're hitting him during his actual attacks, you'd think that's probably moving the phase health. So, why wouldn't you just be able to not do phase attacks? I mean, obviously that'd be slower, but, like... If you didn't do phase attacks, would that, like, prevent him from going to another phase? I have... No. You would assume so. I've done... One second, sorry, it's hard to talk and do this. Hey, he's dead. Oh, you can do phase fire? one w with only, um... You can do phase one with um two spotlight attacks and only one inbound set. Huh. Unless brewers outside, like brewers outside, uh, count as something else. It's weird. I have no idea, honestly. I can't believe you have to actually like fall the way down here just to get the time. Yeah. You'd think there'd be an easier way to get back in bounds. I mean, That'd it's be a huge time save. Yeah, it's like almost thirty seconds or something like that. Hmm. Um, I have. It's some like Razor Mouse or something like that, and I'm on a laptop, so <laughs> I use that keyboard. Wait, what's the thing with grooves to get back inbounds? Uh, no idea. I, I'm assuming it's like the same thing. Oh, no, it isn't! Because you don't actually start the fight. Oh, is that what it is? I've never yeah, actually seen it. and then, it. like, you kill, you basically, you kill grooves, and then you go back to the front of the stage, and then you walk into the trigger to start the fight. Hmm. And it's really funny because a dead groove just starts fighting you. Like, the timepiece is already there, and then there's just a dead groove trying to fight you. Until he just dies for no reason. It's actually really cool to see. Even if current patch mega patched it in Haboy with the cheese reference. Which is actually pretty cool, though. Respect to the devs for acknowledging a patch. I'm surprised they didn't put a cheese in finale after that. They should put a cheese. So I haven't done. Or skip. I haven't done um, heating up without any relics um, in a very long time. You just don't get the relic. Forehead. No, I'm saying I, like, it's been so long since I've done it. I'm surprised I didn't mess it up. Wait, are you doing old heating up? 
I don't know new heating up. Oh, you don't? I've never practiced Burrow Clip. Oh. Uh, it isn't that bad if you get the ledge grab. But, like, if you don't, then um, good luck. Have fun. And then say hello to the raccoons for me, because they are murderers, like cold-blooded. They kill you, and they mean business when they do. It's like even worse than she came from outer space attacking you before you get to the <laughs> mafia guy. It's like they just murder you on the phone. They don't care. Do you think I have enough pawns? I don't know, because I can't see your pawn count. 283! <laughs> oh my gosh! Why don't you just get the scooter? <laughs> I don't shit. Oh my gosh! Why'd you get so many pawns? Alpine. Dang. It sounds like a reroute to make, like, less pawns or something. There is a hundred pawns in illness alone. Wow. So like, does this route have any trouble with mounts? No. Since heating up is like moved to the end? Yeah, there is literally okay. no pawn trouble. Like even better than any percent. Literally no pawn trouble. <laughs> Dang. That's hard to achieve. But it's not when you have a hundred free pawns. You think Alpine would have like unlocks, but since it's all free room, it's kind of surprising because you don't. You only spend money on one chapter. Two. Wow. Two. Mafia Town and Battle of Birds. Oh, that's so dumb. If you only put it in one act of Mafia Town. Two in, acts. Like, a bit of Battle of the no, three acts in Mafia Town. Okay, I'm just dumb. Wait, three? She came from outer space. Okay, I just give up. I don't know the acts. I don't know how many you have to pay for. I was thinking it was only Battle of the Birds, and I'm like, okay, well, cheating in the race. That's that's it, right? Oh, wait, <laughs> cheating up. up. Yeah. Oh, wait. oh, she came from outer space. Okay, well, I mean, that just slightly changes the count. Oh, wow, no mail room. And you're totally on a uh, world record. Like Just honestly, like world record. Oh wow, that's I'm a free world record. You're already like at it. Dang, this is a free category. Dude, Doka has five and a half minutes of time saving his run. Dang. I'm gonna take the all axe world record. Yeah. <laughs> I just have to learn all of the Alpine levels. Which means I might as well just do ATP. Because I still have to do Conductor, and every reason you do ATP is there. Just without the time risk, which I actually like. No, but like, this one was not so good, honestly, and I'm still like a minute and a half from world record. I don't know, Doug, what was your exact time? Was it 105.15? Uh, 17, I mean? 105.10. Oh, it was 10? Alright. I have, like, the page open. Ah, okay. Yeah, I'm expecting to get around a 107. Easy third place. You know, considering I'm second place a spy, I'm not mad. I don't care if he did that run, who knows how long ago. Two months. Yeah. And the other one, six months. Wow. Old cat. <laughs> then you see world record 15 days ago. Wow. We have, like, no record runs at the top right now. No one's ran this since New Toilet, and that seems a minute. Well, I mean, Doka's run, but aside from that. I'm talking about any percent now. Like, 
all the times there are like old now. Oh really? Yeah. Hmm. I mean, 15 days ago, you got a bunch that are hitting a month. Honestly, out of like the times that you see when you first loaded up after is like the latest one eight days ago. Dog down. No. And then sewer with 10 days ago. That's My dog's trying it. to get up on the couch with me. That's going to be really awkward. <laughs> Daisy? She's trying to Tell give you me what. A I'm going to make another bet. And it's going to decrease the time before I start ATP. <laughs> it's going to depend on Flyer's performance in his run. If he does bad, then I'll just wait for him to do the guide. Let's see. What's a good expectation for a marathon run? If Flair gets a 44. <laughs> <laughs> that's a good His expectation. Time is a 44. That's a crazy expectation. Now that sounds reasonable, right, Doka? If he gets a 44 on marathon. Or I'll make a even more funny one. If Connor beats Flair. <laughs> Alright, okay, no, okay. You see? Okay, so Doka, I'll take you up on that. If Flag is a 43, I'll start ATP. Right now. Like, right now, even even before he's done his run. I'll just start it. If he gets a 44, I'll do it, like, whenever he does his run. But, you know. But if he gets a 45, um, I'll maybe, like, do it after SGDQ, you know, whenever he makes, like, a guide or something. If he gets a 46, screw ATP. <laughs> but nah, I, if he gets a 44, I'm doing it, like, right away. For no reason. Alright, come on, Cherry Face. Be better than my ATP PB. Bless RNG. Alright, alright. Still better? Still better? I'm watching this. Uh, Still this better. Looks, this looks great. I'm literally not kidding. This is still better. This looks amazing. Alright. 2.5. Moment. Then there's 3.5. A 3.5 cherry. That's still better. Wow. Well, I had four cherry. Tap I got a six play. cherry in my PB. That's that's pretty bad. Three in a row didn't do anything. Honestly, like my cherry phases have gone to like nothing. Honestly, Yoshi, I need your luck for cherry phases. I I need my luck for cherry phases, and that's just throwing the cherry on her at this point. <laughs> because it, the it's one cherry. Bouncing on her. <laughs> yes. He's bouncing on her to the other side of the arena, and you gotta like, go get it. And the cherry doesn't work. Basically what happened to you. I've been getting that a lot more. Not as bad, but... Wait, was that... Did I just see a Noak potion? Yes. Hargers. You don't have that. Not like this. This team's good. Alright, well, about two and a half minutes off world record. <laughs> Considering that's her first run, <laughs> world record's free. Pogers. I really need to work on uh, Finale, seriously though. That was just awful. <laughs> yeah, third place. Third place world record. <laughs> I like that. How about this? 
F W R that Does that actually stand for something or is that just random text? Yes it does. Am I gonna get to know what it is? World tracker this. Else it's a world tracker. <laughs> That's what this is. <laughs> Four more world records met after someone else's world tracker. Very creative. Very creative. That means anything's a former world record. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I could submit a two hour time and it was a four hour. Four... What? <laughs> two hour <laughs> run and it was a, a four, four hour. hour. <laughs> <laughs> a former world record. <laughs> I, I mean, at some it's point. Four hour. To, to, uh, that would have been a world record at some point. And that may have been the first record, but. <laughs> I wonder what the first time that was submitted for this game was. Uh, Hold up, wait, isn't there the thing that you can, like... Yeah, you can check, I mean, you can check out the Wait, here we go, world record history. Here we go. Full game. 80% is the red one. The first submitted run was an hour and 36 minutes. Hmm. And then the first... <laughs> I like that picture you sent me. <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> okay, the first ATP run was three hours and by Crimson May on October eighth, twenty seventeen. Nice. And then it was taken down to two fifty three in just two days. And then it was taken down to two seventeen. And one more day. <laughs> wow, it really lowered. Then any percent dropped like 31 minutes. And then it started dropping really slow. Wow. I like how Aris doesn't even show up. Oh, wait, no, it does. How about all acts? Let's see that. All Axe started at 152. Isn't that like the bottom run? That should be funny if all the runs were submitted in order. Up until now. I don't think all of them are. Jezway. Filter. Obsoleted runs. Oh wow, there's actually a bunch of obsolete runs. Dang, just why? It's hiding behind this. <laughs> 